Hi, this is Devin from Crunchgear.com, and uh, I have got myself a Via R2Go A2000 system right here. Uh, it's totally raw, it's got nothing in it, and uh, so I thought that I'd show you guys how easy it is to take it apart, install some RAM in a hard drive, and you know, close it back up, and uh, you'll be ready to go with a bootable flash drive or whatever. So let's uh, take a closer look at the thing. Just uh, adjust the camera here. Oh my god, okay. Okay. Perfect. So, here it is. This is the front, obviously. Pretty featureless USB port. That's going to be good later. I need a bit. So, we'll just take off these little screws back here. They're very, very tiny. So I'm going to hide them. Oh my god. Okay, there we go. I have already lost both of them in a huge box full of styrofoam popcorn. And in you go into your little box. So once we do that, this thing should just slide right off. Put that down here. Well, yeah. Okay, and then this, I believe, stays on the back. So we turn around the front, there are these little tabs on the inside here. Just push them out, give it a little push. Push them out, give it a little push, and you're set. So you can see all the guts are just totally exposed in there. Now I need to get my little dim out here. So, ooh. Okay, so you just have to get it to go in at a 45 degree angle. Sounds easy, but actually it's not. Installing dims is easy, it says. Really, let's see. There we go. There we go. Perfect. And stop. And it's got a little locking mechanism in there. That's kind of cool. All right. So now, got our hard drive here. You should go right in there. Boom. I'll spare you the uh, screwing in part. Let me just skip ahead. I was getting the hard drive screws out and I found these little guys. These have got to be the smallest screws I have ever seen in my life. Let's see if we can get a close up. Look at these little guys. That's my finger. All right, moving on. I've just screwed in the last screw. So this thing is pretty rigid in there now. So we put the top, or the front rather. Just back on like that, solid. This piece goes on like so, backwards, that, that also works. You put it on forwards, you give it a little squeeze because it's got these little tabs. Let's see, I think I've gotten it there. And voila, you are done. Oh my god, it's got little screws in the back, obviously but they are uh, really annoying to get in there, so we're going to leave that alone. So now all we need to do is hook it up to a monitor and uh, boot it up with some Ubuntu or uh, Windows 7 or whatever. We'll do that next.